Hello guys, um, I'm here today, or better yet tonight, to film a video on the things I got for Christmas. Um, this was supposed to be uh, filmed on Christmas, but it's actually December 26th now, because it's past like 12 o'clock uh, here where I live at. It's like, probably like uh, 12, what time is it? It's 12.44. It's not actually uh, Christmas anymore, but... Um, I'm just going to show you the stuff that I got for Christmas that's video game related. Uh, I didn't get as much video game related things this year just because, to tell you the truth, in December, um, it just wasn't nothing that really came out besides, uh, what, GTA, um, the trilogy, which I got that on the Xbox Series X, which is, you know, dig I got that digital. And then, of course, Halo Infinite. So, yeah, that was pretty much it that came out for December. So, I pretty much didn't have nothing to really buy. So, this is the little bit of stuff that I got video game related. And I just picked up some games that I missed out on. And just picked up a little bit of stuff because I really couldn't find nothing this year. Because I guess I buy too much. I don't know. But, um, the first thing I got is this. I wanted to get this anyway. Uh, this is the Luigi Lego starter set or uh, course. Um, it's a Luigi one. Truth is, I don't really plan on opening this. Like, just like when I got Monopoly last year and my mom bought it for me, I didn't open it. So this I really don't plan on opening, even though I kind of want to take this guy out of the box. I don't have the Mario one because Mario is not my guy. Luigi's my guy. You know, I was always player two anyway. Because uh, that's the reason why I happen to love this character so much. It's my favorite Nintendo character in general. Because I was always player too. When it used to be only Mario and Luigi on games. I used to always pick Luigi and my brother was always Mario. So, yeah. I got the Mario and um, Mario. <laughs> the Super Mario um, Lego set. Or better yet, Super Luigi. Even though that's not the name of it. But yeah. It is the uh, starter course. This is the only one I'm getting. I'm not getting I just wanted this guy in here. Like I said, I might open it just for him, but I don't really plan on opening it. But yeah, that is the Luigi uh, starter course. And I got a Supreme box, honestly. I was like, nope. All the raggedy boxes, I was like pushing those to the side in the store. But yeah, that's the first thing I got. And the um, other things I got uh, are these uh, calendars, basically. This is the uh, Mario Kart calendar, which I'm going to... Wow, you can see my lighting. Um, I'm going to uh, hang this one up in here, probably over there, because it's a good amount of Mario stuff in here. So, yeah, this is the Mario uh, 2022 uh, calendar. Here's, like, the pictures that's featured on there. It's a 12-month calendar. I thought it was more than that, but it's a 12-month calendar, and... Uh, it's a Mario Kart calendar. And the second one I got, I bought two of them for some reason. And I dropped something. But, uh, yeah, I bought two of them. And I keep dropping things, damn it. Uh, here's the uh, second one I bought. This is a uh, Legend of Zelda one. Um, that's obviously from the Doors Mask. But, uh, yeah, Legend of Zelda... Um, I believe this one is 12 months too. Uh, but yeah, it's actually, you know, as you see, that's Majora's Mask. But um, it has pictures featured from uh, different uh, Zelda games that we, um, you know, that we all play. Got Breath of the Wild, got Wind Waker on here. Um, um, I don't see nothing from Ocarina of Time. Uh, we got Twilight Princess, um, Link to the Past, uh, yeah, but, uh, yeah, that's the, uh, Legend of Zelda one, the lighting is popping up on there, but yeah, this is my Legend of Zelda one, this one I'm gonna hang up, I have no clue where, because I obviously do not need two calendars in here, so, uh, yeah, that is a, another 2022 calendar, and the other things I got were these i picked some of these up on black friday and some of them i just kind of went to the store and just bought 
because I didn't have anything else to buy. Like I said, December was a slow month for video games. Besides, like, everybody was looking forward to Halo, and I was too. So, that was it for December. It wasn't a lot for December. But, um, the first uh, one I'm going to show you is this. This is, of course, one of my favorite, favorite franchises. The beloved Assassin's Creed. Well, I love Assassin's Creed. Some people were really want cold on it. But this is from Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, uh, yeah, uh, Assassin's Creed t-shirt, truthfully, with my t-shirts, my video game t-shirts particularly. I don't really wear them for regular clothes. They're like, I either wear them to work, gym clothes, or uh, pajamas. So, uh, yeah, this is, or if I'm feeling like in a festive mood if a game is coming out or something like that, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, Assassin's Creed Valhalla t-shirt. This one was $19.99 at GameStop, but yeah. That's the Assassin's Creed Valhalla t-shirt. Uh, another t-shirt I got is um, this one. This is a Mario, uh, Super Mario Brothers, like, um, question mark block, and it's made of, like, the items and whatnot. But, uh, yeah, that's a, another shirt. Hey, like I said, they're 19 at stop but yeah that's another shirt question mark t-shirt another shirt that i got this took me forever for the shirt to come in the mailbox this is a super metroid t-shirt with samus on it of course but uh the super metroid t-shirt and the last t-shirt is my beloved xbox series X t-shirt like if I didn't own Xbox Series X I honestly wouldn't buy the t-shirt but uh yeah no I, well you gotta own it to buy it I mean to wear it right but yeah I also got a white one but I got the white one for my birthday so the white one already been the warm but uh this is the other one that I bought and it is the Xbox Series X t-shirt and of course it's a Xbox Series X as well but yeah that is it for the uh t-shirts and then other things I got are actual video games. Um, first game I got to show you is this. This is Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl. I actually bought this on Black Friday. I was like, well, might as well save it for Christmas. And plus, Black Friday when I bought it, it took forever to get it shipped here. Because for some reason in the store, they didn't have this game like sold out. For some reason that game stopped. Like, you, you pretty much couldn't get it. So... I had to order it off the website, so I gotta, of course, open it now. So, yeah, I don't expect much of this. I expect, like, a Smash Bros. clone that I'm probably not going to enjoy, but, uh, yeah, I heard that. Oh, it's fun, but the execution is kind of raggedy, so. That is Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, and there's your game card in here. And, uh, there that is. But, yeah, that's your, can you see it? Okay, but, yeah, that's your Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl. Uh, I don't know why I'm putting this back in the case, but I'm going to put it in my video game case. Uh, another game I got, it's another thing I was in GameStop, uh, literally yesterday, well, the day before yesterday now, uh, before, uh, I'm sorry, actually, that was Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve, I picked up Ghost, uh, Runner, I wanted this game, just it's, it's like a cyberpunk type of feel to it, well, look, aesthetically, it looks, you know, very cyberpunkish, and, uh, it's very Ninja Gaiden-y, I heard, and I love Ninja Gaiden, so, uh, yeah, um, Ghost Runner, got this, I'm not sure how it runs on the Switch, but I heard on other consoles it ran fantastically, on the Switch I heard they improved it, but, uh, yeah, that's Ghost Runner, I heard that it was better, and improve so I'm gonna see what this game performs like so uh yeah that's Ghost Runner the other thing I got is this and this is uh Shim Shimagami Tensei 5 originally I was not going to get this game and like people was like it was basically like adult Pokemon <laughs> so um I decided to uh, pick it up just because I heard that it was pretty good. So, yeah, Shimigami Tensai 5. Uh, 
Yeah, that is. Oh, at least I got some art on the inside. Got some art on the inside. Here's our game card. Like they say, you're fighting against. I don't know. Angels, demons, something like that. It is something. They say it's basically like Pokemon, but like adult Pokemon. So, uh, yeah. Shin Megami 1075 is something I got. And also, with video games, I also ordered uh, World War Z. That comes on Monday for some reason. Like, I ordered it. This Basically, I ordered it from Walmart. Walmart was like, we don't have it in stock. And then I went to Walmart last night and had a shitload of them in stock. I was like, bro, somebody just didn't feel like doing their job. The goddamn game was there. So, uh, yeah, but World War Z, I have that on Monday. So that's for all the games that I picked up. And my dog is barking for some reason. But, uh, yeah, that's the video games I picked up. Because this was the only thing that was really available to me. And the last thing I got in, um, is this. My good old niche gift. Um, I got this from my uh, dad. Because my dad bought the other one. For me last year, the Game & Watch uh, Super Mario World, which is right back there on the shelf. It is right there, okay? Okay, but yeah, this is the uh, Legend of Zelda one. And of course, I dropped something. But uh, yeah, this is the Legend of Zelda one. Let me open this up. Now, we already know it has, like, the cover thingy on here. It's not actually, like, you know. I mean, I'm sorry. It's a sleeve that's on here. And they put these big-ass stickers on here to mess up the thing. But, yeah. Sleeve. As you see, retro-looking box. I like it with the sleeve on it. But, yeah. Sleeve goes on top of it. Like, we know. But, uh, yeah. Retro-looking box. Uh... Does this have tape on it too? Let's open up the box. I don't want to mess the box up because my other box is like straight. Like it's like not messed up in any type of way. But okay. Here we go. Okay, I'm not struggling. <laughs> I'm not struggling. It has a little uh, Triforce on there. Does it have like Special thanks to you, little thingy on there. Let's say it has a little Triforce right here. It, instructions. I believe behind this Triforce is our little bitty charger. I believe it's a charger right here, because the other one came with a little bitty charger. Yep. It has our little bitty charger, little cable there. And I low key, I keep these in the boxes too. I don't really mess with them. And here is our little bitty gaming watch. And that is it. So let's see how we can do. Does it have power? <gasps> and that's so dope. It actually makes a noise. <laughs> oh my god! Look at that. That is pretty. These screens in this color. This is pretty. Like, the screens are very, um, they look pretty good. So, where is the time button? Oh, wow. And then it got, of course, like, um, Legend of Zelda, Zelda's, Zelda, The Adventures of Link, and Link's Awakening. I didn't realize it had three games on it. And then it had, like, the ball game. And this is our timer. I need to select the correct time. What time is it? It is 12. Oh my god. But what is you doing? It is 12. No, no. Nope. That is not the time. Okay, apparently I got set. I forgot to set the time on this thing. But uh, I'm trying to go to 12, and it's only going to like 10. What am I doing? Um, no. And it actually says 12 p.m. But uh, yeah, this is our Legend of Zelda Game of Watch. I got, I got to at least set the correct time on it. But uh, yeah, that is, uh, that is it. 
that's all the items that I got for Christmas that's video game related because like I said it wasn't much to get in this uh, month of December besides things that I pretty much missed out on which I feel like wasn't a whole lot anyway and then I like bar t-shirts for no reason calendars for no reason whatever like <laughs> that was it I couldn't I couldn't I just couldn't find a whole lot of stuff this month because I bought so much stuff already uh, just in general and throughout the year, I feel like, far as, like, video games. So, at the end of the year, even when I see, like, the Black Friday stuff, they be selling stuff that I already bought, and it be already on sale. That that part's a little disappointed about it, but, yeah, like, I'm not gonna wait for it to go on sale, but, uh, yeah, that is it. Um, this is the end of this video. Um, Merry Christmas, everybody. Hope everybody had a nice, um, you know, Christmas, just in general, um, if you got a little bit of stuff, a lot of good stuff, just hope you had a stressful, a non-stressful, peaceful type of day anyway, so, uh, yeah, cause mine was fairly decent, like, I was happy with the stuff that I got from, like, family members and whatnot, so, uh, yeah, and then, like, y'all probably say, well, it's about spending time, so I'll see my family every day, <laughs> so that part really didn't matter to me. So, but I did get, like, some cool stuff from my brother and whatnot. He gives me, like, by far the best gifts for Father besides my father and my mother. And she's not so great at picking gifts. But, uh, yeah, that is, uh, it. Uh, like I said, Merry Christmas, everybody. And thanks for watching. Bye.